folks welcome back to my channel so if you like this look stay tuned this is my pretty much every day i'm about to go outside kick it with the kids to the park or go you know to walmart kind of like the no makeup make look makeup no lip make look however you say that <laughs> but this look is for anywhere so and it's a contouring but without looking over done over contour so if you like this look stay tuned and it's a full tutorial springtime natural time you guys have a good one okay starting with la girl pro concealer in the color toffee and i already got my eyebrows um, previously shaped um at the my local beauty salon beauty salon and basically i'm just outlining it with the concealer i don't do too much um coating and, and filtering just a tiny bit so what I do first is I just outline my natural shape of my eyebrows <clears throat> and I just kind of blend it in and then yeah, keep blending, 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 blending. Yes, kind of give it a harsh lines. So what I do do is at the very, very end is when I add a little bit of like, like a pretty much an eyebrow extension because they're kind of thin at the end. So that gives it more of a natural look because I just follow my shape and I just color it to just the tips give a little more assistance, a little bit more help or support should I say <laughs> and that's pretty much it for the eyebrows just continue um, brushing it in and blending it in to get rid of the harsh lines <clears throat> this is like the most tedious part that's why I'm only doing one eyebrow yeah pretty much and so next, I don't know why that was so dark, is I'm using my one of my mini foundations, which is L'Oreal True Match in the color of Cappuccino in 8. And pretty much just put it on my face. I like to use my fingers and dots. I don't know why, but that's what I do. And I take my sponge, it's already pre-wet, pre-wetted, just slightly wet it and just blot it all over my face. I find that when I wet the sponge, it lasts longer, it looks better, um, and this looks really good. So basically, I'm just going ahead and keep blending it in. Blend, 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 blend. <clears throat> yeah, it just, and it, and it seems like it makes it look a little bit more, like more full coverage as well. So yeah, just keep blending it in all over. And then I realized I forgot to put on, yep, my e.l.f. Eyebrow mascara. So I'm going to apply that now, and that just kind of just keeps your eyebrows. So yes, gel for the brows is a must. So in this video, I did not use any primer. I don't always use primer, but one thing I do um, that I use not more lately now is the LA Girl um, Pro Concealer um, Color Correction. So what it does is I just highlight my dark areas with my little dark spots just to tap it, not too much because you want too much underneath. And just rub it in and it kind of just blends in your dark areas. And then what I did after I blended in is off camera I added a little bit more foundation on top. And then that's why I have the more even skin tone in the bottom. And I'm going back over with the same um, LA Girl Pro Concealer color toffee for my highlighted areas my under eyes um, chin and my forehead and then it's going to continue to blend in I don't know why I probably was talking to one of the kids because <laughs> they stay in the mix so pretty much just um, you know blending in um, to hide all the you know and, I, and the reason I like the color toffee is because the fawn to me is just way too light. I like the toffee because it blends in more of my skin. It's more of a um, brown, a red brown undertone than another one. And yes, I finally got a hold of this Sasha Buttercup setting powder and I love it. So what I found is that it's better for me if I use just a little bit. I don't use too much of it because when I do, I find it makes my skin look very ashy and dry. So um, I just use it lightly and I let it set, but not too long. And so while it's setting, I'm using my black opal um, concealer in the color. Oh God, I forgot. I will put that inside the description box. Okay, got our members, Suede Mocha. Yes. 
So what I'm doing is blending it in my cheekbones and my forehead. That way you give your skin a more of an even look all the way around. And then now I'm going in and I'm blending in the setting powder. Like I said, not left on too long and not put on too heavy. Therefore, you don't have a very um, ashy look, especially if you have dry skin, it's hard to keep your skin moisturized. You don't want to put too much of this on. Blend, blend, blend. And then now I'm going to use the same um, black opal um, suede mocha on my um, bridges of my nose and just blend it in and give it more contour look. Yep, and just keep blending, keep blending, keep blending, blending, blending. And ooh, doesn't that skin look beautiful? Melanated Power Girls. So now I'm using my Black Opal setting powder that I use all over my face. And I love this, this powder, you guys. And that's in the color Dark 04 is what it's called. And it just gives my skin a nice even tone. It blends it with my skin. I use that for all seasons. Like I feel like my skin tuck doesn't change so much. And now I'm using my Zuri um, Flawless <laughs> Setting Spray, which holds the foundation and part it together. Make sure it does not move and go anywhere. And then now I'm going to go ahead and do my eyelids. A little bit of eyeshadow. I'm just keeping a very, very natural look today. This is my natural go everyday spring color look. And... <clears throat> Same color pro girl concealer. Oh, my hands are just ashes. I don't know what. Anyways, now I got this from my local beauty supply store, and I don't even know what it's called. It's so old. The name is ripped off, and it was like $2.99, maybe $1.99. It was really, really inexpensive. And then now I'm just using the e.l.f. Um, eyeliner to outline the top of my lids. And then just a simple black eyeliner for the bottom and then pretty much and then for my lips I finished up with the simple MK lip liner and then lip gloss the lip gloss okay so my phone had run out of storage so I had to go but pretty much that is it like comment and subscribe if you enjoy